Hi everyone, Malibu Sean Beatman here again, and you know what? I've been thinking lately. Over, if you pay attention to my videos here on YouTube lately, uh, over the years, I've been talk thinking about talking about the U.S. teams in the CFL, which I think has merit. You see, seeing a some U.S. teams in the CFL does have merit. So that people in America, America can learn a little bit more of the Canadian style. If they are having kind of a withdrawal from the NFL after the Super Bowl. So Canadians, so we our football starts a little bit earlier than theirs. Say, I think around May, late April, early May-ish. So people have a few... So, they, so the American fans can have a, a little time to regroup, just pay attention to hockey for a little while, and then segue into Canadian football, which is pretty good. But where should these teams be in the... U.S. Division, if the CFL does go back down to America. You see, I've been looking and I say, you know what? Have a team in Portland, Oregon. Have Actually, like I said, have a team in Portland, Oregon. There was have a team in down in Miami. Have a team in Kentucky because... And also have a... Have a team in St. Louis, which they lost their CFL, I mean their NFL team. So, why not put a football team back in Seattle and have a team in New Mexico? So, it'll be nice seeing having the Southwest have a team in that re area again in CFL because there's couple in Texas, couple and or in Arizona, and also there's have a team in Reno or in Las Vegas, Sacramento, for example, and also have a team in Columbus, Ohio, and also let's see, Milwaukee as well. So you have to think of places that makes sense for the U.S. division, which is a good idea to have. And so they can, so uh, if you have it, and that, so they can see that state, can, so uh, the, the states can, those regions can actually learn the a little bit more of the football rules, and also if. When say I don't know if a team had for Mich had a team in Milwaukee for playing CFL rules, and a certain player on that team, after, because of free agent, they can actually transition over to the NFL and go to the Green Bay Packers, which I think is a good idea to collaborate with the NFL once in a while, have interleague play instead of having NFC versus AFC. I say why not have a one week in September ish, no CFL, no NFL games, have interleague play, have the teams from different from the CFL face off against the teams from the NFL and half games in CFL rules and the other half in NFL rules, which see will the will the NFL players that never played CFL rules can actually beat CFL players with the CFL rules and fields and which will be good and also vice versa when seeing CFL players play on smaller fields and or more down. It'll be a nice way to actually transition them from seeing how good a certain the, the league is if they 
go from NFL to CFL or CFL to NFL because, well, some NFLers actually came to CFL if they got cut down in America or when the CFL players transitioned from American, from Canadian football to American football. Which I think is a good idea to have, having, like I said, have, have American CFL teams and also have, and having it like that as well. And this is Malibu Sean Bateman signing off.